questions for Nash? No, uh, yeah, we got most of the guys. Everyone, Colt Feast, he had a wedding on, he has a wedding this Saturday that he has to go to, so then we're going to get him after, after his wedding's done. But yeah, majority of the guys did. Uh, it was T Rob kind of got the idea going, and we told, uh, told us all, it was, we were all on board with it. And then, so yeah, that was, T Rob kind of started that. Uh, the, night, the night before camp after fan day. Uh, no, honestly, it feels good. Take the helmet off, breeze hits your head. It's pretty nice. Oh, yeah, absolutely. How are things shaping up uh, on the interior from your perspective? Uh, really good. I really like the guys we have. I think, you know, most, a lot of the guys, all of us can play. Um, we're getting better and closer every day as a unit. That's what I love most about this unit is we're all really, t we're a tight knit group. We all really care about each other and, uh, Love playing, being out there and playing for each other, and that's 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 what's really awesome to me. Kind of a read of you got on Stefan Wynn um, as a new guy in this. In your he's a really good dude. I uh, love talking with Wynn. Love getting to know him even more. He's uh, I think he's going to be a good player, and good asset for us. Um, and he's yeah, he's going to be very very helpful. Yeah, I mean, I was, it's always it's always cool to get a guy from a program like that. You know, talk with talking with him. It's uh, he said when he or he I think said something about when he got here. Um, you know, he was worried about us not having the right attitude, and he said, "Man, I can't believe the attitude you guys have for what's happened in the past." And um, that's he's come in, got right to work, and uh, we've all I mean, we love having him in the room. It's awesome. How does he embody that? Oh, yeah, yeah, Ty. How, how to practice, Ty? If there's, if, you know, there's something going on he doesn't like, you're gonna, you're gonna hear about it. He's kind of the first guy that uh, will get fired up about something or whatever. And so, yeah, he, he's got no matter where, who, if, if whatever's going on, you know, he's gonna have your back. And the same with all of us, you know, something's going on, we got each other's back. At the end of the day, we're just trying to play football and win games. So. Oh yeah, no, he he can yell. He uh, he's a, he's definitely a loud person. And sometimes you gotta cool them off a little bit, but I mean that's just how that's how it is. Uh, I mean I can't wait. I've been wanting this for the last couple of years, and then this is the year. I'm really expecting to play a big role this year, and that's uh, that's what I'm most looking forward to, being with the guys playing football. Oh yeah, just uh, just speed, learning the game, getting um, just getting getting off, using my hands. It's just, I mean, just getting used to the game. I guess I don't or I don't even know how to put it. I, but yeah. What specifically did you do to work on speed? Um, just working with Doss, doing drills. I mean, just getting better, focusing on stuff, little things. It's kind of the little things, you know. You can't leave those small details out. You got to work on everything. Can't leave anything on the back burner. Um, no matter how good of a player you are, you know, the, the best ones are the best at the fundamentals, and that's what I've been working on. Yeah, no, it helps just with body position, leverage, all that. It, it, it does help. Sometimes it makes a guy, it seems like in the, on the line, three or four years, like playing the Big Ten level. What have you noticed about what it takes to play it? You know, go through the grind. Yeah, no, and that's that's sometimes what it takes, you know. Um, not many deal linemen come into the Big Ten and play fre their freshman year. That's just how it is. That's kind of how it's always been. You got to be a special kind of player to do that. And so that's just, I've been working, trying to get as best I can, as quick as I can, get out there on the field and play. What is the difference between how you have handled the physicality of practice now as opposed to how you handled it when you first got here? Uh, I'd say I got a little more of an attitude now. That's the biggest thing for me. Yeah, I mean, I'm not taking no crap from those guys, and they know that. Just being physical, just out physical, and everyone playing uh, tougher than anyone, anyone out there. Does that mean you used to take crap? Uh, no, not necessarily, but I wouldn't give it back as much now. So, but yeah, no, I don't. We're that's what we're all about in the Dion. We're playing physical. We're getting off the ball. We're being the toughest guys out there. It's like a line, a fine line to walk, where you know you 
kind of need to be patient, but at the same time, you probably want to be out there. Yeah, way, no, right? it's been a fine line. Um, you know, you got to be patient with it, and you know, you know when you're you want you want to get out there, want to get out there. It's one of those things you just got to keep working. You know, it's going to happen. If you keep working harder than everyone else, playing tougher than everyone else, it's going to happen eventually. So that's what it, that's kind of been my attitude. And but yeah, I've always been chasing that. That's all I've been thinking about is getting out there, playing in front of ninety thousand. Anything else? Perfect. Perfect.